right, so we're nearly at the end of day three. How's it going? Tired. How can you be tired? You're not pedaling. <laughs> you have no idea how uncomfortable <laughs> this thing is. Pretty windy, as I'm sure you can hear. Uh, I've been parked for about five, ten minutes now, and already there's a sand dune starting to form in the lee side of my van. Just a really strong crosswind. It's quite tough, this. Right, well welcome to uh, the sport vehicle uh, and what was my home for a couple of years. We have a spare diesel cam there um, and there's another another diesel cam there. Uh, we have the cooker, there's plates and stuff under it. The water, little electric tap there with 50 litres of water underneath it, that can keep us going for a few days even in the desert. Um, some food storage, the cool box, very useful that. Cool box with a melon in it and some fruit and so on, powered by the solar panel which I've got on the roof. Yes, there it is. Cool, so what's that in the day eight? I suppose so, <laughs> I've lost count. Okay, day nine. That's it. The first time a solar bike has ever crossed the Western Sahara, just powered by the sun, no pedalling. And here we are at the Mauritanian border. <laughs>